Hi, Carlo. Hi. Hi, Carlo. Uh, Everton, top of the table tonight. It's uh, a perfect start to the season. The best start in uh, 126 years. How good were Everton today? Uh, yes, we are really pleased uh, for the start. We did really well this period. Um, winning games, um, showing good quality. The spirit is good, as I said. We are really pleased, but it's only the start of the season. Now there is the, 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 the international break. Uh, we can have rest. It was a busy time. Um, and uh, come back. Uh, we have to come back with the same spirit and the same attitude. And Calvert-Lewin can't stop scoring. A word on him today and also a couple for Hammers. I think that in general, uh, the, the attacking football were, uh, was good, was good because we had uh, opportunities. On, so we were um, really clinical on set pieces. We were really good in counter-attack. We played a complete game. Also, when we defended with the low block, uh, we were in good position. We defended well. And so I am pleased. Obviously, the conditions were terrible. Were the conditions a factor in Jordan Pickford's display, do you think? Yeah, I did a mistake, but uh, nothing happened. We have three points more, and so this is the most important part. What about the Richarlison and Coleman injuries? What can you tell us? Uh, small injury, I think. Uh, Coleman, Richarlison had the same problem that he had against West Ham in the Cup. Uh, so... Uh, we have 15 days to recover them, and I, I think we will be able to do so. A couple of final questions. Ben Godfrey is about to sign, we think, for Everton. What's he going to give the club, do you think? I think it's not, it's not official, and so we are interesting, but until he is official, I don't want to talk about this. And a couple of days uh, left on the transfer window. Is it possible that you could be willing to let Walcott, uh, Keane or Besic leave the club in the next couple of days, Carlo? But really, as I said, I'm not focused on this. I think that our technical director is working on this. Uh, and so there are players that want to leave uh, to find an opportunity outside the club. I think that we have no problem to let them to go. Thank you so much. Sam Morrison, please. <clears throat> Hi, Carlo. Hi. What would you say about your opponents today? Obviously, you had to stay alert. They're obviously good going forward and scored scored two good goals. So, what would you what would you say about how they played? What do you think of Brighton? Well, oh, Brighton is a team that like to play. As I said, maybe not always they are with a good balance. We work on this. I think uh, the strategy was to defend well at the first, uh, and uh, I think we defended well because they are used to play a good football and uh, and we have to suffer when you have when you have to defend i think that we were focused to defend and after that when we were down we had the opportunity in counter attack and we were really clinical there thank you oh, hi carlo um you've spoken about your good start to the season and how important consistency is. And then you've said today Pickford made a mistake, it didn't make any difference. But how concerned are you that that might, you know, affect the consistency issue if you're, if you're having to cope with a goalkeeper making errors? Well, well, I think that... I think that this is the, not the right place to talk about about Jordan Pickford. If I, if I had to say something to him when he comes back i'm going to talk to him 